Yo, what's good, y'all? Welcome back to another vlog. Today we are doing back and shoulders. Fucking get this shit. I do have a story for y'all, though, and a little bit after this set, right? Basically, two people fought in the gym. It was pretty fucking funny. Basically, I don't know what happened. I don't know how it went down. I don't know what the fuck even like was the problem. I just walked over to like the entrance of the gym and it was two people brawling. So I'll send you the clip right now. There's a fight outside of the gym. Yo, look at <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> That's pretty much it. I didn't catch a lot of it. I didn't catch the full throwdown. I really wish I did. I could have though, but I didn't really have a good like view of it. So I wasn't gonna get a view of the camera anyway. So then I caught like a little glimpse of it, but it was so pretty funny though, like to watch anyways. But like, that was it. Now let's get back to it. Today we're gonna talk about more like. So then we're gonna talk about why. I don't, what I mean by why, I mean like, why are you doing what you're doing, right? Last time we talked about consistency and hope, you have to have that hope, but that hope also matches with the why, right? Why you're doing it, why you're hoping it's gonna work out, why do you continue working to the hope to into reality, right? So that's what we're gonna talk about is the why after this set. Woof, we got many more sets to talk about, to talk to. You. So the whole point is like, why are you doing everything you're doing? Why are you going through all the hustle, the pain and the suffering you're going through for what reason, right? That is the point of the why, why you're doing it. We can have a lot of reasons to like why we're doing something, but out of all like the 20 reasons you can have, you're probably gonna focus more on the three main reasons why, right? For someone asks you, why do you do this? You're gonna list the most important ones first, right? So like the main three whys, I like to say, right? Why are you in the gym? Why are you vlogging, right? Why are you consistently posting those reels and everything, right? I mean, I haven't blown up, you know, I'm not I'm not some famous person, I'm just some regular person in society, but like, it's it's the why we do everything, and it's the why we continue to do it. You know, whether that's to help people, change mentalities, add a new face to the world, you know, maybe do something with your personal brand, it could be your family, it could be something, you know? Those whys are gonna really help you out in your journey, not only with your hope and your consistency and your discipline, that why is gonna make everything else feel like a breeze. It's a hope and a why, right? We got a plate 25 on here. We're gonna go ahead and, honestly, I don't even know how many I'm gonna do, but we'll, we'll see, we'll see how it goes. And then we got machine auto raises. I don't even know what this is called. I just know there's auto raises. And then we got front delts, super set. I'm listening to fucking turn me on. I usually do the 20s for my front delts. For some reason, fucking 22.5 is for fucking for another level, man. You know, every time they say out of 2.5, I get scared now. Because, hey, 2.5 pounds on top of like a good top set is, you know, humbles hella hard. hard. How are you guys doing? How's everybody at home? How was school? How was work? How was the business? How was how's everything going? You know, quickly checking for me. It's the usual trade, work, more work, and then repeat. Okay, things every day, guys. Honestly, this thing's different. All right.
This is free that I'm saving. I mentioned it like two videos ago, but never showed you the bottle. I think last video, but never showed the bottle. It's called Edge of Insanity. That's just crazy. I ain't gonna cap. It does wonders. That has me locked in. Like, I'll lock in and focus on something randomly. I don't even know what I'm looking at on. That's no idea. Like, this gym is mostly like black and green. So, I'm not like, there's like little knobs for the machines to like, what level you want it to, and it's green. And I'll be like staring at that for a minute. And then I catch myself staring, and I'm like, oh shit. There goes me staring again, guys. You know what I hate the most when using machines, and the machines are right in front of each other, and you guys just lock eyes. Like, when you guys are using cables, and I have to look at like the sky or some shit, or pretend like Blue's Clues is looking around the corner, and, or like you're getting jump scared by like the nightmares, and I don't know, bro. It's just, it's just not fun. Alright, let's put these fucking dumbbells back and go move on. Fuck all this bullshit. I got bras in the lamp. Twisting the lean in the fan. Credit cards in the scammers. Hitting off flicks in the band. Black and six, fan. Buy this and like a panda. Going out like a Montana. All right, so moving on the lap pull down. I was gonna go do a uh, profit where I did uh, the shoulder thing that you should do for the rear belt upstairs, and then I came down here. I didn't really film that because it's just me moving my arms up. Not pretty much any list when somebody wants to pass. Okay, is that the camera like like two, three steps away from me? And some people like to walk like in the middle of it somehow. But I understand right now because there's like stuff all in the back. Like for some reason, there's a deadlift bar like right there that like, literally right behind the camera and then someone moved the bench super close to it so like you don't really have like room to move like that guy just moved it you got tired of it all right let's get this shit I don't need really the cable rows, but we're gonna do them slightly bented so it hits a lot. I'm not really doing these precisionally really heavy. It's like 70 pounds for 12, just so like you feel the tear. Cause you really wanna like engage the mind muscle connection for these. So now I'm gonna start going heavier, but you wanna do the mind muscle connection first. All right. This is our last set. We're listening to a song called Break Shit. The bike is officially dead. I can feel it. I need to do rows. I do not want to do rows. The other one is the barbell rows. Last workout, I'm going to go home. All right, let's go do rows. I'm not going to lie. I'm hella dehydrated for some reason. Oh. Last set is the best set, guys. Last set is the best set. Let's get this shit. Yeah. Like, lifting is just so much work, and running, you just kind of like, it's on your head, you know? I'd much fucking rather do cardio. All right, let's go to the fucking posing room. All right, I made it to the posing room. Now let's pose. Let's start with the high usual. Oh, I forgot to do abs. That's pretty much it guys, if you guys enjoyed the video, I hope you guys leave a thumbs up, subscribe if you don't want pump to do a new one next week. I hope you guys have a lovely week too. Later guys, peace.